Welcome back guys to Crypto for Life channel and today I finally decided to show you the video instruction detail step by step how you can use my indicator set and increase your win rate in trading. Let's dive in. Regardless of your trading style, intraday scalping or swing trading, you can use all these indicators to increase your win rate. There is no single perfect indicator, so I created a set that will save you a lot of time. This is not a magic button money, but by 80% you can more accurately and easily make decisions about buying or selling crypto or any other assets by combining all these indicators. You can set an alerts on this indicator so you don't need to sit all day in the front of charts. By combining knowledge of technical, fundamental analysis, some world news and this set of indicators, you can get a ready-made set for successful trading. All indicators can be used on different time frames. The higher time frame, the strongest signal. Your entry or exit point should be based on several indicators from the set, your trading strategy and your own risk management. Indicators cannot predict or analyze the future events in the world, the release of data in economic reports, statements in the media, by public figures or something. So always follow your own risk management when you open trades. And by the way, this indicator set works even on free trading view plan. Let's start with CryptoFolite trade on indicator. This is one of main indicators what I use and this indicator can be used on totally different time frames. But everything depends on your trading strategy and risk management. This indicator has five alert variations. Buy or sell signals. This signal appear when you can open a position for buying or selling. Stop loss can be set according to your risk management. Entry into position can be at the appearance of the buy sell signal and the closing of the candle. Stop loss by the body or a week of this candle. Another entry point is to wait for the closing of 40 or 50% of the body of the candle in which you saw the buy sell signal. Stop loss by the body or week of the candle on which you saw the buy sell signal, red or green triangles. Once a buy sell signal appears and you enter a position, you have a several options. It all depends on your trading style and the risk management. The first options. If, for example, you enter it on the buy signal, you can close the position at the appearance of the take profit signal or at the appearance of the sell signal and open position in another direction. The second option, after opening position when triangles appear, this is a signal to close a certain percentage of the position in profit. With each new triangle, you can close percentage of your position and move the stop loss to break even. The third option, after opening a position at the appearance of triangles, closing a full position and looking for possible option to open a position in another direction. Take profit signal. This signal appears when you have to close 80 or 100% of your position and wait for the appearance of new signals or triangles. But everything depends on your time frame, what you trade and your own risk management. Two identical signals in a row. If you see Two, for example, signals to sell. In a row, you can take a position in a parts and then you will have an average entry point. Stop loss by the body of week of the last candle with the last signal. Notifications and alert options. You can set the alert by yourself depending on the time frame you are interested in. When you will get the full indicator set, you will go to indicators and in white only scripts and you will see all six indicators. Now let's take a look on a real example how trade on indicator works. Just for example, it's the YDX daily time frame. On totally different time frames, you will see the more and more signals. The lower time frame, the more signal you will get, but the more noise you will see on the charts. That's why it's everything depends on your trading style and trading strategy. So let's take a look on daily time frame, the YDX chart. So here's, for example, we got a signal, first signal to buy and second signal to buy. Just for example, if we open position here at a signal to buy, here we got a first triangle. It just recommendation to close position. So we can step by step close some percentage of your position. Here's a signal to buy. Till first signal recommendation close position, we got 90% profit. Till next one, this one is 110%. Next one, 132%. Next one, 141%. And the last one is 
54%. Let's take a look for a short position, how it play out on history. Here is a signal to sell on the YDX. And here is a recommendation, close position. Here is a signal to take profit. After signal take profit, we got, after two days, we got a signal to buy. But I recommend you use all indicator set to combine and to find out the better entry point, not based only on one indicator. So just for example, if we sell it here, even not on the top, till signal take profit, we got 59% profit on short position. Then we got signal to buy, from signal to buy, till recommendation close position 43%, next one 72 and here is a signal take profit from long, 129. Every single time we got a chance to pump it higher. That's why it's only about your trading strategy and time frame what you trade. Here's an example 30 minutes time frame, how you can use this indicator on this time frame. If you're a scalper or so. Here for example, you got a signal to buy, recommendation, close position, almost 2% pump. If you're a scalper, you can use the triangles like a signal to open position in another direction. From triangle, you can open position in another direction till signal to buy 5% profit in short. Then you can open position for long here till next one 3%, 4%, and 7%. Also, you can go to alerts here, choose. CryptoFly trade on indicator and choose the signal you want to see on your specific time frame. For example, we can choose the sell. So now if the new signal to sell appear on 4 hour time frame, we will see the notification on our application trading view. Next indicator is CryptoFly direction. This indicator will help you determine the direction of the trend in the market depending on the time frame on which you trade. The higher time frame, the more accurate the direction of the market movement. Direction indicator can help you making a decision to enter or exit the trade. Signals are divided into two types depending on the direction of the trend. Circles will appear from above or below. The circles will signal that the main market makers are starting to reduce or gain their positions. Big players always need liquidity, so they can build or reduce a position for quite a long time. Round dots are not the main signal for the trading. The green and the red dashed lines are the levels where the big players are more likely to start gradually selling off or gaining the position to change the trend before the momentum. Let's take a look how crypto flight direction works on real example. Like you can see on a daily time frame, we drop it down to the bottom and start trade in this range, almost one year. And on crypto flight direction, you can determine every single time when we see the pump, accumulation stage, pump, accumulation stage, and this candle, pump. Then sell, accumulation stage, pump, this candle. Accumulation stage begin and confirmation for pump. Then we can see the opposite way. Last time when they push the price from $1.25 till $3.66, we got distribution and confirmation to sell. After this confirmation to sell, here we got drop 27% and 45%. But like I always told you, you have to use this indicator set in complex. CryptoFlight ADZ, Accumulation and Distribution Zones. This indicator that reflects the accumulation and distribution zones. And now you will see how ADZ indicator works on real example. Here is a daily time frame, and here you can find out and determine the huge divergency on a daily time frame. The higher time frame, the strongest signal. Here we got lowest point $1.54 and the price drop till $1.11. But on ADZ, we can find out the big players at this point start accumulate a lot. That's why we can understand the big players accumulate, for example, at $1.54 and at this point $1.14. The average price can be around $1.40. After this divergency, we can see 
distribution on a chart. So with this average price $1.40, just for example like this one, they push the price higher almost 100%. And now in opposite way, you can see the distribution divergency. Here's a distribution, huge distribution at this point, $1.91 and the lowest point but higher on the chart at $2.71. This indicator include totally different metrics than RSI or the MACD. That's why it can help you to determine more clearly exactly the accumulation stage or distribution stage. Also, we can go to alerts, choose CryptoFlight ADZ and choose which one signal you want to see on your chart depends of your time frame. CryptoFlight money power indicator. This indicator has the blue overbought down and the yellow oversold edge by default. This indicator analyzing the data will show you the inflow and the outflow of money on different time frames from the big investors. When the asset reaches one of these zones, it can serve as a good signal to close or open position. An almost perfect signal for deciding whether to enter or exit position would be divergences on the price chart and the curve on the money power indicator. Like usual, you can add the notification, you can choose the top, middle and the bottom alerts options. Let's jump to the chart and take a look how money power indicator works on real example. Here we got uh, $1.30 price on the chart and we got a divergency on the chart with the price and divergency on money power. So from this price in September at $1.30, price dropped to $1.12, but the big players start to accumulate. Big players always accumulate step by step and they made a better average position. After this accumulation, we can see they change the trend and from this the emergency, they pump this coin 140%. I love this indicator so much. It's a crypto for light market mode. This indicator that reflect the mood and interest of the crowd in an asset of the market. The older time frame, the more clearly the mood of the crowd is visible. On different time frames, you can view the mood that is currently present in the market. Trend aphoria, position selection, or lack of interest. Red and orange color of a bot in the market. Green, it's accumulation and purchases on the market. Yellow, it's gradual set of position. White, purchases and lack of interest from the small retail investors. And the blue, neutral mood in the market. Now you will see how market mood work on real example and you will be so impressed. We got extreme red color. It's time to sell and like you can see on the chart, it was the time to sell. Every single time when we see the white color, it's time to buy, time to accumulate. But I highly recommend you use market smooth for investments on weekly time frame. Here just pure example how it works. Distribution, all this time period, it was just a distribution more than one year distribution on the YDX. And then we saw the accumulation, accumulation from August till January. In this time period, the big players accumulate this asset. And then after accumulation, they made a huge pump, over than 200%. Depends of your trading style, depends of your time frame what you trade, you can use it on totally different time frames, but the higher time frame, the more clear signal for this indicator. Crypto for Light Take Profit indicator. This indicator works perfectly well and it's almost the best accurate indicator what I ever seen for swing traders and for investors. Let's dive in. This indicator was extremely good win rate even in the spot or futures. Every asset has a price 
and the real value. Analyzing the data, the indicators can give you the opportunity to enter position both on the spot market or on the future markets in four positions. In settings, you can choose the style and the color of the lines just by your light or dark time. The best win rate for this indicator is on 12 hour time frame, daily time frame, and for investors, it's a weekly time frame. Investors can take a position by always buying when the price drops to the fundamental value line. The first lower buy line when the price dropped to this line is a good point to enter a position or gradually build a position. The bottom at green line, it's fundamental price is the real value of the asset. Sometimes when the media background about the asset is negative and the buyers are not interested in assets, the price can fall below its fundamental price. Then this is the best time to buy an asset. The first upper take profit line is a line where you can lock part of the profit or close the entry position. The very top exit line is a line where you need to close 100% of the trade position. But if you're an investor, you don't need to close the enter position and exit the asset because all lines are dynamic and all changes just depend on the cycle of the market. Let's take a look on real example how take profit indicator works and how you can combine a few indicators to determine the best entry or exit point. Let's take a look on daily time frame. Every single time when we drop under fundamental price, the last line is fundamental price. We drop it under from our price, find a support on some levels, we buy in the asset, we get a pump 66%. We reject it and drop it one more time under from our price. So we still trade it here. We buy it again. You can use it for trades or for DCA strategy. We buy in here and waiting take profit line. We hit take profit line 170% profit. When we touch take profit line, we can use futures and open short position just by your own risk. Here, for example, we touch take profit, but also we have all chances to go into exit line or even higher. That's why you always have to use stop losses. Just for example, we touch second time like confirmation take profit line. For us, it's a signal to open short and wait the buy line. We touch the buy line here, reaction 56% profit on the futures. After the buy line here, we open long position and wait, take profit 83%. And if you hold till exit line, it's 142. From exit line, you can open position on the daily time frame to the buy line again, 63% profit. And like you can see, we didn't come back once again to the fundamental price. So we touch the buy line again and we skyrocket over then 200% on a spot, even on a spot. Not all indicators have a lot of data for analysis like uh, DWX, it's a brand new token. That's why take profit can show insane, insane good result uh, on the coins like, for example, Bitcoin. Because this coin got so big history for analyzing. That's why, look, how you can combine the trade on and take profit indicator. We turn on. Here we drop in June. We got a two signal to buy. Here's signal to buy. Here's signal to buy confirmation. And we drop under buy line. Here is a touch of buy line again and signal to buy. From this touch, the buy line and confirmation on trade on on the daily time frame. First one, till recommendation close position, it's 20% pump, then 25, 29, 33, and at the top 35. It only depends on our trading strategy, so we can wait, for example, take profit line or close our position. Then we got FTX collapse and we see one more signal to buy. From this signal to buy. And like you can see, we didn't touch the buy line again. That's why you have to always combine technical analysis and indicators. From this signal to buy till signal take profit, we got 14% pump. Here we got signals to sell. 
and almost touch the take profit line. If we open short here at the signal to sell, recommendation close position 9%, take profit signal 17% profit with a short. Then on daily time frame, when everybody screaming we go into zero, we got a confirmation and new signal to buy. Two signal take profit, we got 27% and now we got a two signals to sell, 46%. And like you can see, we still didn't touch the take profit line or even exit line. And like you can see also, these lines are dynamic. They start curve up. That's why we go to weekly time frame and we can determine. We drop it on a weekly time frame under formula price one time, second time. Every single time we got reaction. That's why most likely, based on analysis, we have to touch take profit line and exit line on the weekly time frame. The higher time frame, the strongest signal. You can hold your position and wait, take profit line and on a weekly time frame. And I think in this area, when we touch the take profit line or exit line, we'll see the signal to take profit from this one buy signal and signal to sell. So it can looks like this one. And in this area, we will see the new signal to buy on the weekly. Guys, I hope you like this step-by-step -step tutorial how to use my full indicator set six in one. And finally, you can start using and increase your win rate in trading. If you wanna trade with my custom request set what I showed you in this video only for one dollar per day, just write me DM. Subscribe channel, hit the like button, hit the notification button, and don't forget to join my Telegram channel. See you next time, guys.